I wanted to believe in Sasquatch or Sam Squanch or but I'll tell you, I'm glad I didn't have to play hide and seek with him when I was a kid. We'd still be looking for him. This is just a nice little trail area I walk. Savannah River Bluffs. Uh, I pick up the trailhead in North Augusta, South Carolina. This is actually a heritage preserve. Like I was saying before, it's roughly around a three mile round trip. Just a nice little morning walk through the woods, through spider webs apparently. But, yeah, I don't know. Headed out on the trail, ran across a couple of deers. I go into one open field pasture area. You cut through. Uh, it's kind of hilly. When you make the loop on the back side, you got one big hill to start and then one small hill as you go and then at the end there's a there's a very big hill. It's just nice. It's quiet, it's peaceful. It does get used, but every time I come out here, I might run across one. Maybe two other people, that's about it. Never end up running across a lot of people. But, it's a nice little trail system. You know, if you're in this area, and you're with, you got kids and want to go out for a couple hours, this is pretty, uh, this is pretty good for that. Gives you that really kind of secluded feeling even though you're 15 minutes walk maybe back to some houses uh, like I said it's going to be probably my first YouTube video with audio in it if I can ever get it recorded I mean I'm going to figure out how to upload it but yeah you got a couple of little bridges like this to walk across. Some little little tiny creeks, but I'm sure when the river and the water are flowing, that thing's probably pretty big. We haven't had rain down here, serious rain. Probably God, I don't want to say three weeks. Get a quick little rain shower and it's gone. It's almost like we're in Florida. It's been hot. Whew. <clears throat> 99 degrees, heat index of 105, 102. This morning I woke up and said, you know what? 73, the humidity's low. Be a nice morning to take a hike down to the river. So I hopped in the truck, grabbed my water, grabbed my walking stick. Ten minutes down the road, and here I am. Hiking up and down these trails. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. I mean, I'm wearing a pair of Air Jesuses, a pair of shorts, got my walking stick, and uh, a bottle of water and a pocket knife. That's it. Don't really expect too much. Just a nice, light walk through the woods. Sound like I'm out of breath because I'm a big old fat guy with that smokes, which makes it even worse, right? But maybe if I get out here and start doing this stuff, it'll uh, encourage me to quit smoking. I should say, get out and do more than what I do now.
I don't know about editing this. I think I'm just going to uh, try and upload it raw and see how it goes. I haven't really written down any content or anything to discuss. I just like to get out here and go enjoy nature because you know you get cramped up in an office all day Monday through Friday oh just walked into a big old spider with across my face whoever removed that case he's poisonous which I hope he's not oh there he is look at this is the guy I just walked into creepy Creepy. Let that spider scare me. But it's just that nasty feeling. Sorry about that. Just that nasty feeling of walking into a cobweb. That's all. Yeah, so I kind of woke up this morning and decided to do this. It's either going to be uh, it's going to be either be a trip in the kayak, go do some fishing, or take a walk in the woods. I haven't taken any walks in the woods in a while, so I said, let me go take a walk in the woods. Either one is just as good. Anytime you get out there and enjoying Mother Nature and what's been put for put here for us to enjoy without it being destroyed or paved over or built upon, it's always a good thing. Always a good thing. I came out here three years ago, these bridges were just about falling apart and I watched the paper to see if they'd put anything in about looking for volunteers to help come out and fix them. Came out here one day and they were fixed. So, tried to do some of that volunteer to help work on certain stuff. You know, something that I benefit from, something I hope future people can, will benefit from. I don't want to just start throwing money out. Because then it's just a, I don't know. It seems like you could take more pride if you actually did some. So, I don't know if you can hear it or not. 
but like I said this really isn't a, a big long walk but there's a little stream we've been following and uh, if you can hear it that's the Savannah River you can hear This place is getting used, but not as much as it was when I first started coming out here. Apparently there's bass in here, from what I've been told. One of these days I'll actually have to bring out the fish pole and see for myself. But... This is root system for this one tree right here. This is gnarly. Real gnarly. This is the Savannah River. You can kayak down this. Um, there's a beaver, a uh, river otter. I think that was a river otter. Yes. See him jumping in and out of the water? I'm going to step back and take my seat and let's see what happens. Talk to you in a while.